Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Game It Out. We're playing a game called Mr. Maze. Everything about this looks sick. New game, let's get into this. Scrap Palace, the name uh, that this gonna involve a lot of walking? you Americans seem to be driving on, shall we say, the wrong side of the road. Are you on vacation? Ah, uh, Mark J. Lovegrove, my favorite. Ah, there's one thing I like in my puzzle games. It's about 10 frames per second. Well, here we are at Scrap Palace. I'm going to be your host. Can you come with us, Mom? Sorry, honey, I've got an appointment in town that I really need to keep. Sorry, honey, but I really, really don't want to. Is going to help you tackle the maze, aren't you, hun? Yeah, sure. It yeah, sounds like something I'm gonna do. All right, look at that. Where is that stupid maze? How come we have this piece of crap when all of these other awesome families have like muscle cars and classic cars? Are we like that crappy hippie family? All right, you dumb kid. Let's go. Sure, sure, mazes. And afterwards, we'll visit the amazing pub. <laughs> you alcoholic. Have a nice time, both of you. Go on, Penny. Enjoy the maze. Is my daughter like 14 going on 40? Pick you up in a couple of hours. Sure thing, my love. See you later. My love? See you later? Affection? Is this the woman you're having an affair with? Where's your real wife? I like the part where Penny here is uh absolutely out of her mind excited and nobody else cares. Who is that guy in the window? Is he selling tickets? Did he get lost on the way to Comic-Con? Are you excited, sweetie? You bet I am! Penny, are you high? One adult and one child. Have a wonderful time. That is the exact voice I was picturing for this person. Come on, Joffrey. Joffrey. Awesome. It's maze time. Bye. <laughs> Dad's like, well, Next hopefully I'll never see you again. Can I just skip this crap? Everyone out of the way. Get out of the way, you little idiot. Penny, shove through there. Show him what's up. I'm so sorry. My handbag. I had it with me a few minutes ago. I stole it. Get out of the way. Um, Search the area for clues? What? I need to find this woman's wallet for her? Did my wife say she had errands to run? Was her errand to just drink by the car? I hope by clues they meant I'm just gonna put my mouth over the exhaust here. Going around the parking lot looking for someone else's wallet. Whoa, 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 whoa. Guys, the chupacabra's back here. This is like a plot. Oh, God. Okay, this is a plot point. Let's inspect it. That, that didn't inspect anything. Okay, let's just go over and, uh, well, well, well. Let me get this straight. The grandma has a muscle car with a spoiler on it. Sorry, did you forget your purse after racing for pink slips? I'm just gonna jovially bring this back to you so I can finally get into this maze and get us to the pub faster. I assume this father over here is just waiting for his kid to just never return from the maze. It's like all the parents know. Hey lady, found your purse. Excuse me, madam, I found this handbag in the car park. Thank you. I'm Paul Walker. One adult, one child. Have a lovely time. Sir, you're not on the stage. First of all, you can sit down and two, maybe try to make eye contact with someone. Excuse me for just a moment, please, sir. I, I don't. F*** it, we're going in. Penny's back there just like, wait, daddy, you can't set such a poor example. You mean I can't go this way, game? Why are you suppressing my knees like this? Hey, Andrew, let's talk. Why are your hands so big? Hello, Andrew Harvey's the name. Please to meet I you. don't care. Is this your first time? Is this my first time in the maze? Yes, I think it is. You think it is? I completed my first maze at age five, you know. <laughs> it was the Basildon Park Edge Maze. Maze design number 69. Two whole miles of head. I've never wanted to not hear a conversation as bad as this one. Let's see, we have ourselves a Meister Maze as aficionado. <laughs> she definitely likes Meister mazes. mazes. Cool, so she's like the maze junkie. Oh, Remember that kid in Jurassic so Park that loved dinosaurs? She's that, except with mazes. Hey there, theater dork. Two tickets, please. Welcome, sir, and young lady. Welcome to the Scrap Heap Challenge. Actually, it's just Scrap Palace. No one asked you, Wikipedia. All right, you all, young miss. <laughs> the Scrap Palace. Now, will that be one adult and one child? Uh, just yeah, one child. Please. I'm just gonna wait out here. Certainly. That's a 20. Here's 550 for you. Thanks, sir. Hope your play goes well next week. I'll totally check out your improv show. No one checks out improv shows. Okay, Penny, don't get lost in the maze. Well, kiddo, what are you waiting for? We're gonna die, Daddy. You can follow me if you want, Dad. Yeah, I'll be there. I'm right behind you. I'm <laughs> Dad, you're not following. Dad! <laughs> Hold shift or left mouse button to jog or run. Uh, no, we will not be doing any of that. Daddy's had a hard day of having to raise you for the last 10 years. Daddy's gonna hope there's live munitions on this field. Woody, why are you waiting for me? <laughs> Slow go, 
coach. Ah, that old American phrase, slow coach. Hold on, your dad's being a slow coach back here. Penny, no, no, come back. Penny, I'm trying to catch up to you. Oh, so badly. Wait up, Penny. <laughs> Even the voice actor is just like, yeah, wait up. I didn't have my methamphetamines for breakfast like I normally do. Hey, Andrew, can I have a cig, please? Andrew, your glasses, Hello, they're yeah, like Andrew. in the fifth dimension. Are you having fun in there? Uh, no. Observe the things around you. Memorable features can help you navigate. Andrew, what's wrong with your shoulder? Thanks, Andrew. Penny, Penny, wait up. I was in f a maze. Please, for the love of God, can you help me? Hello, officer. Lovely day, isn't it? No, the captain had the nerve to put me on maze duty. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, sometimes I wonder why I ever joined the force. Yeah, seriously, you never expect to be put on maze duty. Let me get this straight. There's actual police officers patrolling the maze for children. Is this like a government maze? <laughs> like, what is it? Ah, a hoodlum-ish. Hello, young lady. The ground is definitely soft here. Can you feel that? D is anyone here to just do a maze? I bet he's watching us. The maze meister. Mister, can you feel him? Who is this maze meister? <laughs> Are you some kind of maze noob or something? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You have disappeared mysteriously from these mazes for years. <laughs> Better watch out. What? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm not a noob. Peter, you don't have to justify yourself. It's okay, dude. And now she's sitting here like nothing happened. All right, I need to gather my bearings for a second. Let me make sure I understand. So this is like a, a, an attraction that children actually want to do, and it's so popular they have police here and people think that abductions happen hey there miss are you feeling all right oh who cares oh i'm fine and you can call me velvet because that's my name i don't care junkie you said something about people disappearing from mazes what's that all about you've seen those police officers why do you think they're here for people's safety maybe. i love peter's thousand yard stare <laughs> these mazes move from town to town and every time they do, someone disappears. No one knows why or where they are taken. But I intend to get to the bottom of it. <laughs> oh, didn't realize you ran into Nancy Drew here. Then people will have to take me seriously. Uh, you're a young person. No one's gonna take you seriously. Hey lady, thanks for the foreshadowing. I'm gonna go not find my daughter now. Alright, look, I'm not gonna tell you guys how to build your maze here, but I'm just gonna say that maybe if you know children are gonna be in here, don't put a barbed wire segment. Yeah. At this. Hey, f you, Penny. Hey, Penny, where are you? I can't see you. Okay. Uh, oh, there she goes. <laughs> we'll see about goddamn that. Whoa, whoa, Peter. This is your daughter. Just let her win. You can't be the one that gets abducted here. She's never gonna solve the puzzle to rescue you. Uh, hey guys, I think we have a problem. It looks like you've got some reindeer. Hello, large creature of unknown origin. Excuse me, but you're in my way. Hey, f you. Huh? Uh. Oh, well, there it goes, just straight to hell. What the hell was that? <laughs> it was the Maze Meister, duh. Okay, here's the thing. All of this could be easily explained that the dad pounded some pills before they got here, and now he's just tripping balls while he tries to keep it together going through a children's maze. That's what I think is happening here. Haha, <laughs> can't catch me. Who said I wanted to? Yeah, you tell him, Peter. I can't describe how long I've been in this maze, but I think it's been at least a year trying to figure out how to get out of it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think this is it. I think we found the way out. Oh, crap. Is this it? No. I cannot imagine any city would authorize this maze. This is just asking for kids to die on the regular. Look at this. With the sheet metal and stuff. No wonder kids go missing. They're getting decapitated right here. Oh, the exit. Thank God. Get me out of here. What are you doing? Stop that. Oh, yeah. Oh God! <laughs> okay. Well, when you're ready, Penny, I'm heading to the exit. Yeah, Penny, you stay here and you do you, and the rest of us normal people are just gonna, you know, go back to real life. It's still happening. I. I... <laughs> This is one of those things that the longer you sit here and watch it, the funnier it gets. Don't worry, she'll tire herself out. Please let the exit just be a giant pit. Okay, I'm coming. Hang in there, Penny. I'm coming. Just... All right, this better be good, Penny. Oh, oh, there's some wizardry. Thanks, you two, for just standing by and watching. I like how all the children are just shrunk down adults. That's what I've come to realize. None of them are kids. And also, the world's worst, most unhelpful dad here just being like, Hey, that's cool. That kid's getting sucked into another dimension. Everything going okay, Penny? Will you swim in space? Are you sure this is a problem? You seem pretty relaxed about this. Get down from there. Yeah, you brat. Oh, no, Penny, what's happening? 
Oh, uh, look at- look how much Peter doesn't even care, doesn't even look up. He's just like, oh, this sucks. <laughs> what in the name of Maze Meister is going on around here? Where are those two, uh, where are those two police officers? They could be really handy right around now. Alright, well, I guess I'm gonna step on the thing and I'm just gonna... Is everybody in this game high? What do you think I'm doing? I'm going after my daughter. <laughs> oh, sorry, Peter. You're dead. No! My death! Sunset Realm. Designed to look like a medieval castle, but we got news for you. It's just a maze. Uh, 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 that really hurt. I broke all my bones. I, I can't feel my elbow. The most vital of organs. Where am I? I gotta get medical help for my elbow. Penny? Penny! How's your elbow? Oh, thank God for better frame rates. Okay, let's check this out. What do we got here? Can we just take a nap? That'd be nice. Thank goodness, an abandoned journal. Sorry, Penny, I've got some light reading to do. Oh God, really? Appetites are strong in the sunset realm. Provisions from the castle are rare, forcing dwellers- Blah, blah, animals, blah, blah, docile, blah, blah. Let's go see what this thing is. Hello, press enter to kick. Well, when in another dimension, take that. Ah, just needed a jump start. There we go. Now it's all activated because I kicked it. Oh, look at this. It's one of those stacks of uh, stones that people put on hikes. Oh, a thought stone. Well, let's touch it. Kicking, touching, it's what we do. Small communities lay scattered about the realms, providing sanctuary to Dude, I wouldn't have run away from the journal if I wanted this. I will miss the vibrant drum circles. Oh my god. Can we once again agree that this game is just one man who is high? Very, very high. Can what? <laughs> hey, it's my Andrew Android password combination. What was that? What the hell? Another journal. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna touch it because I feel like we need to, but there's no way. Cursed is the realm. The greatest food shortage. I don't care. I just, I don't and can't care. Let's just go over to where Satan's trying to block me. That's okay. I know how to get around this. It's to kick this magic rune. Move, please. Is it working? What's happening here? Can I go in? Damn it. Don't worry, guys. It's okay. I found the other magic rune I need to kick. There we go. I bet that was all three of them. Oh, God. Did you all leave journals behind? Was there the rapture? Rox and Rune, strange, don't care. Okay, I think I'm getting a good picture of the story here. Everyone was assigned one Wikipedia entry, and they had to put it in their air quotes, journal, and leave it behind when the rapture happened. I used to work on a construction site, but was transported to this realm early one spring morning. That's cool. Oh, I just had to approach it. Thank you very much. Yes, thank you. Thank you, ancient wall. How did you even surmise that? Just from kicking them? That one's got a tennis ball. Let's kick that first. Press enter to inhale. See? <laughs> what did I tell you? Time to get super duper high. Oh, wow. So that lets me look around. This is not helpful at all. There's a lot of questions I would be asking. The, oh God, what now? Hey, it's that one thing we saw earlier. You again? Yeah, you again. Hi, where are you going? Yes, yeah, sprint away. Wait here. I'm going to kick this real quick. Okay, I kick the thing. No, come here. Where are you going? I must follow. <laughs> I know, dude. I'm sad, too. All right, dear. I did this for you. Well, after you. Thank you! Okay, you have fun. Okay, bye. All right, guys, listen up. It's very clear that I'm not stoned enough for this game, but we're going to make it to the castle, and then we'll reassess from there. Oh. Oh, look at this over here. There's only, like, 20 miles of maze between me and the castle. Wait, can I not kick this? Is it not active? No. Let's go read this person's journal first. Gregory's Log. My name is Gregory. The strangest thing happened today is I was enjoying a hedge maze at the local park when suddenly I stepped into a circle of light and was sucked into this strange land. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure your story's really interesting, except we know it's not gonna be. Okay, so I can't activate that. Can I just jump into the maze? What would you have me do? Uh-oh, cutscene. Person, finally. Hey, hippie! Whoa, whoa, good. A little too close, guys. Excuse me, I'm looking for my daughter. Have you seen a little girl passing through here? He's like, I can see the Matrix. Easy there. Oh, it's Gregory. Hello, girl? Yes, she came bounding through here. I hardly had a chance to talk to her. She seemed pretty determined to solve this maze, and I tried to warn her, but she didn't stick around. Really? Which way did you go? Is anybody here sane? Same way as everyone else. Down into the valley and the maze beyond it. Oh. She seemed real good at mazes. I bet she reached the castle already. I'm sure you'll find her there, or inside the hall of the high dweller. Uh, how? How do you know this? It's a large cathedral inside the castle. The governor of the realm lives there. That's about as far as you can go in that direction. Unless the High Dweller grants you passage into another realm. But who are you? <laughs> I'm her father, and she's not supposed to be here. No one is. 
Come with me and I'll see if I can help you. My name's Greg. No, I'm good, Greg. I'm just gonna find my daughter. Just stare off into space here. Need some help? Uh, no, but I guess we're gonna talk anyway. This rune here won't rotate until two other runes down in the valley are rotating. You'll push it if I go do them, right? That'll get you past one magic wall. Sure. But then you'll need to face another maze. That's fine. Ha! Huh. You sure? Because once you're inside, there's no turning back. Oh, so cinematic. But if you pass it, you'll reach the castle. Same place your daughter was heading. Thanks, Greg. Take care of yourself. <laughs> you don't even know this dude. And look, if you find a way to get me and everyone else out of here, well, you know. Have us all killed. I like that our daughter went ahead and uh, got abducted into this realm. She watched it happen and was like, oh boy, mazes. All right, so we got one of these magic runes. Kick it. Peter, I'm glad that you have a daughter that is obsessed with mazes. So much so that she literally cannot tell fantasy from reality. Oh, thank God it's the other one. Come here. Hey, ah, get spinning. Hey, Gregory, why haven't you tried to do this? Are you ready to activate the room? Shut up, Gregory. I got this. Oh yeah, there we go. I activated the room. I gave it a good kick. Join me by the fire if you want. It's nice to have another person around these parts. Uh, Gregory, there's something happening right now. Are you not seeing magic fly into the air? Are you enjoying the fire? Are you getting ready to fight it? Are you ready to make love to it? What is happening here? You seem busy squaring off with the fire, so I'm gonna let you, uh, have your eternal duel. I'm gonna go find my daughter. Penny, I swear to God, the only thing that's gonna make me happy here is if it turns out that you not only solved the maze, but there was, like, fabulous cash prizes at the end. This isn't how Daddy expected his day to go. Daddy was getting ready to get super duper duper drunk after they did like a rudimentary maze for children. Not going like a magical, hey look I have, oh good it's you. Yeah, good thing I can outrun you. Cool, you can go in the water and be wet and miserable the entire rest of the game. Look at the expectations on this guy. He's like, well, you did all the work the first 10 million times. I'll just stand here and stare expectingly at this rock face. Nope, see, that's what you get. When you expect everyone else to do things, you get sucked into hell. All right, let's activate these guys here for the world's easiest puzzle. All right, Peter, what do you see here? Peter, don't look now, but I think, oh, the thing's just closing behind you. I thought, I don't know, I thought like a golem was showing up behind him for a second. <gasps> Oh my god, there's a person in the mist. Hey, hey, Gregory? Is that you? I recognize the shirt, but you're wearing pants. And you're not wearing those dorky-ass shades. Hey, hey, listen up. Listen, listen. Really, you're gonna be like that? I'm starting to think you just walk in circles. How could anybody actually get stuck in these mazes? Like, if you were stuck in this realm, like, eventually you're gonna find your way through, right? If you have nothing but time on your hands, you're gonna figure this out. But, I mean, you don't need to be like the Einstein of mazes to make it through this. Just don't keep walking in a circle like that other dude. That's why these people can't get out. This looks like the right way. Peter, how do you know that? Are you the maze whisperer? How did this guy beat me here? Hi, you wanna have a chat? No talkie, you're busy? Okay. Hey, did you guys see a little girl here? Where the hell do you guys get your clothes? Shouldn't this be something where they want to talk to us? Like, are they just content being here in sort of this weird netherverse? Wouldn't they see a new person and that would be like the best thing on their agenda for the day? Wouldn't you clear your calendar if someone showed up? What news do you have? How long has it been? What year is it? There's just so many questions or they could just be like, nah, I'm busy right now, brah. I'm busy sitting. I've got things to think about. Yeah, no, I know you came from another realm. I've just got other concerns like writing in my journal then leaving it somewhere. Somewhere. There's the castle. Oh, I made it to the castle. Hell yeah. Out of the way, everybody. It's time for me to be the new king. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you stretch your fine ass in there. Never mind that the door might be locked. There we go. There we go. Yeah. So, where have you gone to now, Pen Pen? Are you talking to the camera? Are you talking to me? Oh, God. No, please, God, no. Walls, walls, walls. <laughs> Is that the hall of the high dweller over there? So. Well, these must be all the denizens that- wait, what? What the hell is this thing? What the heck are you? It's a robot. Alright, move. 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 Can you help, please? I'm pretty sure this person's dead. Wooden plank? Now we're talking. Yeah, yeah. Oh, really, dude? Sick. Yo, robot, less talking, more escorting for the love of thank you. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah, I've got the vapors too, but it's because I'm standing in this fire here. If you can harness the power of levitation here, you can probably find your way out of this castle, right? All right, so I'm going to be honest, I think it's going to take me like an hour just to get through this maze, and I just don't know if I'm going to be able to do that without going absolutely completely insane. But I think we get the gist of this, right? We're just going to run around this maze for a while. We're going to eventually find Penny, probably. We're going to find out that she 
she uh, just still loves mazes. Penny's gonna be like, this is the best time of my life. And dad over here is gonna be like, I wish that I was the one that had errands to run and that mom was stuck <laughs> in the shadow realm with you. So that's gonna do it for this episode of Let's Game It Out. As always, I am Josh. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.